Okay, here we are at the flood in Vermont. Just so people know, here's one of these historic covered bridges. And then we go to the water mayhem here, which uh, there's an illustration, sort of, of just how insane this water actually is. You can see a corral fence in the background partially submerged. Then, there's some more of it. Now we get to this rustic house, which is in serious trouble if we look at it over here. There's the water. There's lots of water. And now we go up the road a ways. Oh, there's that again. Check the, there's some evidence of yonder flood and all. Back to the bridge. There, there. And I guess I'll leave this thing on while we get up to the really wild stuff. There's the... Hold it in. And then... Check this out. Pray hope the battery hangs on for the wild shit here. There's some of it down there. There's the house. And here is... The waterfall. Why would I say anything? Oh yeah. Those the size of the pipe there compared to the stream mayhem. A billowing brook no more. Okay. Ah, here we go again to the next part. More wild shit to be seen. Another covered bridge. Maybe I'll check out the covered bridge. Woo! Then again. Yeah, that place is flooded for sure up there. And this is a tributary of the other river down in Northfield, Vermont here. There we go. There's a road buried over there. And now, should I try to cross over here? There's part of our roadway and our bridge. This thing is huge. Check out the road here. I decide to cross into some of this. Walk across and check out upstream. Actually, probably not. <laughs> Okay, I think I got that already, but uh, there you go. Wild, wild stuff. Aha, I got it to work again. Here's our covered bridge. Had to get this built in 1872. And now, here's our bridge from the other side. Note the size of the uprooted tree that's been washed against this poor bridge. There's some building back there, I saw that before. And here it is going under the bridge that I just 
walked on. Luckily that steel beams underneath so there'd be no more bridge. And then over to the other side, we get this once again for reference purposes. Oh yeah. Here we go again. I wouldn't get too far over the ledge. There's the, see we're a dog house, because look at this. And look at this. You know, you don't want the asphalt to break, so you don't see too much of that. There's the flooded mill converted to mall and shop, converted back to flood water victim. Oh yeah. There we go. Right. Okay, now we're down below. There's the waterfall over there. And here is the mill. I can't believe the lights are on on the bottom floor there back around over here to the raging water going on behind it and all. And this is flowing the opposite direction from the covered bridge area. Or there was another covered bridge 20 yards away where the water was also flowing in the opposite direction. So there you have it. Uh -huh. Here we go again, more in the town now. Notice what's going on back there. The Beware of Dog House, hopefully it doesn't have a basement. And then we get this, whatever that factory used to be, it isn't there anymore. And note way in the background, a very swiftly flowing stream.